Hello, hi everyone. Hi. Hi Ellen and John, producer Hello, John. Hello, It's Hello, lovely to John. see you both. How are hi. you both doing? We're good. good. I'm good. Yeah, good. Everyone good. And yeah. everyone's fine. Yeah. Everyone's fine. Yeah. Um, yep. Well, welcome along well, to this stream. Well, well, uh, <laughs> Now, you will know that the premise of this stream is that Ellen is going to be given a gift, a surprise gift. And it's something that producer John has put together. Yeah. Something that he has made happen, shall mm. we say. Yeah, that's, um, that's, all, that's all true. That's all true. Uh, mm -hmm. The chat is uh, going crazy for seeing us. Hello. Got there it thing. is. Look, there it is. Yeah. Do not There's open. Do not open until Luke says so. Somebody just says that I have a face. Yes. Well, they're right. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah. It, well, if you've never seen John's face before, you've not watched all the show the weekends, have you? <laughs> Yeah. People in chat, hey. Yeah, well, yeah. Not shown the first time we've had John on. Showing yourselves up there. So yeah. go go watch all of the show of the weekends and then come back to this stream. Ellen, Ellen, Ellen put a lot of me in that behind the scenes video as well. Yeah. She did. Yes. So this is very exciting. By the way, Mike is in the chat. Um, Yay. Uh, Hello, keeping, Mike. Keeping an eye on you all. So. So, oops. Ellen. Hmm. What, uh, what do we think is going to happen? Let's have another look at the box. <laughs> John, you did remember to put air holes in there, didn't you? Yeah. Nah, nah, nah. I was like, it better not be like a hamster no. or something, because it will not have survived the journey. Well, I, I, I hear that they can store oxygen inside their uh, pouch cheeks. Pouches, in their yeah. cheeks. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I think so. Welcome along, new member James Austin. Uh, and Tom oh Titherington says special goodness. hello to producer John. Yay! And welcome along also, new member, uh, Tara Fietz. Hi, 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 hi. Okay, so, um, we are going to find out what's in the box, but not with a simple unboxing, not yet. <gasps> oh, yes, yes. Because producer John has actually made a little video. A video that we've, oh. you know, had a camera to shoot something for That's on right. the channel. That's An actual went... edited video, if you can believe what? it. Wow! <laughs> <laughs> Filmed with a camera. A yeah. short video. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness mm -hmm. me. You wow. lucky people. All right, so before we um, go with that, I want to see some guesses from the chat. I'm drumming up the tension unbearably. <laughs> so let me know what you think. Let me know what you think. They will have absolutely no idea. No, I don't think they will. Ellen might have an idea, of course, but um, I don't know. Well, let's find. We'll find out afterwards if she if had we are, any, yeah, if she had if any we, clue. Yeah, because if we if we were to ask her to guess now and she gets it right, that could be embarrassing. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, that could be embarrassing. So let's not do that. Uh, welcome new member Julia Kaiser. <laughs> hi, hi, hi. And Clockwork Johnny, new member. And Runic Knight oh. says, uh, Damn, I outed myself for not watching all the episodes. Don't worry about <laughs> it, Runic Knight. It just means that there's more to see. There's more to enjoy. Mm -hmm. Remember don't... the times when we were filming in studios? No, I don't oh. remember wow. them. <laughs> That's the frightening <laughs> thing. I don't remember. <laughs> uh, Gentle Mandrill says, Teehee, riddle me this. I wonder what in the box is. <laughs> Sorry. I, I, no, I, started I thought reading. we were safe here. I realised that that was in the riddle imp voice as I started the first sentence, so I did a real rapid clunking <laughs> gear shift in voice. Oh, yeah, te <laughs> <laughs> hey, oh, guys, I'm very excited, says Gentle Mandra. <laughs> I'm excited as well. Oh man, we've got so many new members. Uh, Laura Money and Aiden Sharrix. Welcome along. <gasps> Welcome. Matthew Parker says, I'm happy to catch another Oxford stream. I finally got yeah. out of Kuwait. Uh, and the guess is her D&D &D oh. figurine. A Merylwen oh, figurine. It's not amazing. a bad guess. It's not a bad guess. Mr. Happy guesses it's Cyberpunk 2077 and she can't Ooh. open it till November now. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> Joe Schmo says the real gift is all the Ellenings we made along the way. I mean, that is not, that is not true. Um, let me, let's read some other guesses. Uh, Sean Hutchinson thinks purple hair dye. Does it feel like, is it, could it be purple hair dye, Ellen? No. Mm. No. Right. It's probably not heavy enough for that. Oh, oh hang on, yeah. half of my face is frozen. How did, how did that happen? <gasps> oh, there we go, I, I think I oh. fixed it now. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, wow, that. yeah. Oh, crikey. Sorry, folks. I don't know what I did there. Actually, I Lucas. do know what I did there, but I fixed it. Um, Man, yeah, this, you're these live streams now. are just held together with spider webs and wishes. <laughs> um, <laughs> the LX Jane says, "Hope you're all okay. Can't wait to see the gift." 
and Sigurd Ursine says, is this going to be an advanced copy of the New Kingdoms of Amalur? Also great to see producer John. John oh, yeah, I have those connections, obviously. He yeah. yeah. yeah he, can, he, can ha- he can make it happen. <laughs> well, Captain Redbeard guesses it's a Keanu Reeves. Um, now, I don't know Keanu Reeves' height. A boxed Keanu. A boxed Keanu. Could be. Yeah. Could yeah. be. There we go. Look what John's written on the side. Keanu, either. Do not, Do not open. open until Luke until says so. Luke says so. I love it. Yeah. I love yeah. it. Okay. Um, uh, I do actually have a tiny Keanu Reeves. Oh, I- good. That's... Ibuki guesses a voice acting session for Kingdoms of Amalur. Oh, wow. Look. <laughs> it's it's Keanu Reeves, everyone. <laughs> hey, Keanu. Yes. Yes, they can, and uh, yeah, there we go. <laughs> More guesses. Uh, Suiko fan thinks it's going to be an Assassin's Creed cloak. Ooh. Not a bad guess. That would be a very fine present. Yeah. And Karate Kitty 5000 thinks it's going to be myself. a baby bear. Aww. I mean... Not a, not a live one. Not a live one. Well, not alive anymore. Uh, Toffee Panda reckons it's a 3D printing of Jane's face. <laughs> it could be. You never know. Needs. So Where I can like needs. secretly take over outside Xbox. Yeah. <laughs> and um, uh, Zanzibar White says, since I don't know his last name, I guess I could say John Doe has the upper hand here. It's probably something to do with cats. Guesses Zanzibar White. Well, something to do with cats. I mean, Ellen does love cats. So there you go. Josh Taylor yeah. says, does Luke know what it is? Yeah, I know what it is. You better believe I know. Um, something that just occurred to me, Ellen, that box has come fresh from the post. Um, it doesn't mm-hmm. still have any address details on it does it ah there we go good see i thought i could trust you <laughs> <laughs> um evan saunders says is it simon no no i'll, I'll, I'll Wait, say what? that now but no no it's not simon <laughs> andrew kaufman says actually. weird guess but a ring a ring can anyone see if i you see if i make this go close to the camera it will ruin all the focus Got a small Jess the cat. You do have a small Aww. Jess the cat. Bring, bring Jess, bring Jess the cat in a little. In a little, John. I, I don't Is care if it's. Aww. We'll sacrifice the focus. Oh, look at that. Yeah. Kids, ask Jess. your parents about Postman Pat. Yeah. It's just a lucky little Jess because I'm not allowed a real cat in my house. Oh. So I have Jess on my desk instead. Jess, Jess is also good. good. Yeah. Jess is great. Um, well, let's see. Uh, N- Nile Island guesses it's a collapsible box so Ellen can sit in it. Is it an entire <laughs> universe, says Daniel Glynn. It's a shark, says Johnny Munoz. Munoz. <gasps> shark? Okay. Shark. These are all, you know what, Not these are sure. some actual good guesses. Um, I've been like skimming through them all. No one has guessed it. Not, it's not a, a purple so- it, Someone's guessed purple sofa. It's not a purple sofa. It's not a purple sofa. No, no but no. I was very excited when Ellen made her studio in animal crossing mm-hmm. ellen sadly couldn't get a purple one could you ellen but the one that you did find was the same as this one that i'm on now <gasps> so well it looked identical so so that was you know it, it was good it was good nice. for that at least nice. um craig lodzinski says a 3d printed figure of idris elba from the movie cats <laughs> oh please no <laughs> everyone's, everyone's guessing um McCavity! McCavity! <laughs> McCavity, that's. Oh gosh, right. They uh, managed to make take one of the most like handsome and like most beloved actors that like I've gone all blurry because of the cats. Um but like <laughs> um and they just just made they just I watched that film and I was like, no. No. It was I've a seen Idris Elba IRL. He is a handsome man, and they, mm. they, they, the talent to make that man look scary. <laughs> Carlby back says, wishing you all a happy Friday. Ellen already has a surprise. How do you know she hasn't opened it and resealed it? It's not like I've done that at Christmas. <gasps> uh, oh, why would you do that? Root Christmas. I don't, Ellen, you love surprises, <laughs> though, don't you? I love surprises uh-huh. so much. So. Paul Freire guesses a plushy KK slider. That'll be a good gift. That'll be a good gift. Well. <laughs> Yeah, what if one of those exists? They must have them somewhere. I would just like a real KK slider. That's what I'd like. Yeah. Okay, well, uh, and James Howard guesses, is it special rub? (laughs) (laughs) Oh, I don't know. Is it? Let's have a listen. Oh, no, no, No. I don't think it is. Not been able to go. Not not, been able to see Not Tracy's Tracy's special rub. (laughs) All right, and I want you to—I want you both to finish this sentence with me. 
because uh, Hovek, the artist formerly known as OxoTNHK, says, Is it a ticket to the one place not tainted by capitalism? <gasps> Spice! <laughs> No, no. It is not, no. no. It's a pretty mm-hmm. big ticket. If that's Alex big. H guesses Kingdoms of Amalur, but every voice line has been changed to time for work, boys. <laughs> that would be ideal. <laughs> <laughs> well, folks, it's none of those things. Um, should we find out what it is? Yes, I think we should. I hope, I hope nobody's disappointed now because nobody seems to have guessed right. Yeah. Nobody is going to be disappointed. Okay. 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 All right, Ellen, are you watching the stream? Because you're going to need to watch along... You'll be finding out at the exact same time as everyone else. Okay, so I'll be on a slight delay with my reactions then. You'll be on a 30 second delay when we come back with your reactions, but don't worry. Okay, it will will be okay. okay. Right. Okay. You've got the stream? I've got the stream. Okay, folks. Here we go. There we go. Hello, everybody. Jonathan Garnham here. People on the channel also call me Producer John. I have brought you here to my home desk editing area and we are here to do a nice little video for our friend Ellen. What you can see here is something pretty special. This is Ellen's Game Boy bag that she had when she was a really ickle Nelly Rose. She put this in my trust December time last year because I'd recently modded this Game Boy here to have a backlight and what game is in here of course it's Link's Awakening and she gave this to me she thought it would be cool if I could sort it out for her so this is her cool bag official Nintendo bag and we're gonna open it up this is the main zip lo and behold inside is Ellen's Game Boy now this is broken this should be stitched to there So that is a non-technical piece of repair work that we can do. Just some sewing. It's a play it loud version. These were the ones that had all the buttons were all the same colour, whereas on the original DMG you had pink buttons and a black D-pad and grey select and stuff. But on this one, the play it loud versions, they're all the same colour, but you could get funky colour cases as opposed to just the the grey version. And um, it does work. I'm going to turn it on does work. When she gave it to me, it didn't. So that works. That's the best sound in the world. At the moment she's got her favourite game, Dr. Mario, in here, which also works. It works. Everything works. All the buttons work. It's all fine. And as it turned out, there was a lot of corrosion in the battery contacts in here. So I scraped all that out. I didn't even use any alcohol. I just did a little bit of scraping on the battery contacts, put some batteries in. These are rechargeables, of course, because you know, I love the planet, and it worked, so that was fine. But the screen lens is missing. This is what one looks like when it's got a screen lens. On the Play It Loud versions, they didn't have this type of grey, they had a darker grey, so we need to replace that. The, (laughs) The other main thing, as you can probably see, is that it's quite grubby. So the main thing we need to do is open this up and give it a clean. You can't clean it unless you open it up, take everything apart, take the casing into a sink and give it a scrub. So we're gonna do that. Before I show you some cool parts that I've ordered, let's just have a look in the rest of the bag. You can see Ellen's little collection here. She's got Super Mario Land 2, excellent. Super Mario Land, brilliant. Mega Man, yes. Adventure Island, fantastic. Chase, H-O, Secret Police, hmm. And then in here, of course, because she was a big fan of Rugrats, she's got a Rugrats game. I'll tell you something for free. The Dr. Mario cartridge really needs a clean. She obviously played this the most. Before we crack on, I'm going to show you some cool parts that I've ordered. Now this is the replacement screen lens. As you can see, it's darker than the grey of the original DMG. Uh, All these Play It Loud ones had a darker screen lens here to match the the dark colours of these buttons and stuff. So I've managed to get hold of a glass replacement screen lens, not plastic, because as you can see with the original plastic ones they get scratched. But one of the things that also disappointed me is that her, and this always bugged me about Game Boys, 
the um, connector port cover was missing. She should have a yellow one, but she doesn't. But you can see here, this um, this one's got a grey one. That's the original one. That's all fine. So I have ordered from a really good website called Deadpan Robot. Look, they sent me their card, and this is a baggie of really cool plastic purple parts and this is the piece that's missing i'm just i'm, I'm going to put that in right now because i can't resist give you a sneak preview of how brilliant this yellow and purple uh, co color combination is going to look so i thought while we're doing that we might as well replace the a and b buttons on here to purple it's a nice homage to the fact that the original DMG had these pinky red A and B buttons to sort of offset it. So it would be very unique, it'd be very Ellen, because she's obsessed with purple. Because, well, it's a brilliant colour. Hi, voiceover John here, taking over. Now it's time to get ready for the big clean. So if you're interested in doing this yourself, you totally can, it's really simple. The main tool you'll need which you might not have is a Triwing screwdriver. But if you search on eBay for Triwing and Game Boy, you'll see that you can pick one up for a couple of quid. First you'll need to remove the six tiny Triwing screws on the back shell which I'm doing here at incredible speed. After that you'll be able to separate the front and back shell to reveal the two circuit boards inside. To complete the separation though, you need to carefully pull out this ribbon cable from the back board. Then you can begin unscrewing the board from the front shell which is attached by 10 tiny but regularly headed Phillips screws. Ugh, look at the dust in there. This is why you need to clean it in the sink. Have we got it? Have we got it? Have we got it? Come on, yes! Back of the net. This is the whole screen assembly, and by Jove does it need some cleaning, but it's, it's absolutely fine. Next, simply use your fingers to remove all the buttons and rubber membranes ready for cleaning. To disassemble the back shell, you have four more Phillips screws to remove, two on the cartridge board and two by the headphone port. Yeah, look at that. Much easier than the screen. Let's put that, place that to one side. That will come out easily. That's just the power button. The last screws to remove are the four on the metal shield. Finally, remove the metal battery contacts by pressing down the tiny metal tabs with a small flat screwdriver. Then take all the plastic and rubber parts to the sink for a wash in soapy water. Just to warn you, this process can be extremely satisfying. I find using a fresh toothbrush is the best tool to get in all the nooks and crannies. However, careful how you go on the printed text on the front shell. I barely scrubbed over the start button hole and I'm ashamed to say managed to remove what little remained of the word start. Sorry, Ellen. When it's all clean and lovely, leave it for a day or two to dry before you carry on. Before we reassemble, there's a few more jobs to do. I tried to restore Ellen's cool bag and managed to stitch the broken Velcro strap back into place. Looks a bit crude, but that thing is on there. However, I later discovered that there was some more damage with some popped pocket stitches and some fraying around the top of the dividing area. Probably best that I leave that as it's clearly beyond my sewing skills. This didn't stop me giving it a clean though with some hot soapy water. Next, it's time to introduce ourselves to some good old isopropyl alcohol. Yes, it's 99.9% .9 strength, and yes, I'm pouring it into a shot glass, but that's only so I can dip my cotton buds in. The reason for this is yet more cleaning. The alcohol is strong enough to dissolve bits of dirt without damaging the electrical parts, and it dries really quickly. First, I'm cleaning the grubby bits on top of these cartridges to make them look like new. Then it's time to clean the battery contacts, the speaker, the button contacts on the boards to improve responsiveness, 
and dab some isopropyl into the dials and ports to dissolve any dirt. Another little trick you can do to restore the buttons is to rub the dark part of the membranes onto some paper, like a pencil, to level off the surface. Last but not least, some regular multi-surface polish and a microfiber cloth will bring up the screen and metal shield nicely. Okay folks, now for the fun part, the best bit. Can't wait to get these purple bits and the new screen lens in. Let's start putting it back together. Let's get the shield in. These are Philips ones going in first, don't forget. The uh, only time you need to use the tri wing ones is to seal the back shell onto the, the front shell. Everything else is Philips screws. Next I'm gonna put the battery contacts back in. Okay, they're in, put that on there for now. We can now attach the cartridge board. I just need to make sure I put the power button, the new purple one in at the same time. We're putting purple bits in. I'm more excited about this than when I backlit the Game Boy Color. Because this is just gonna look like a piece of art. Even if Ellen doesn't play this ever, she can have the coolest shelf ornament. That's in. That's in. I feel like I want to put the ribbon cable back in first because this is tricky. I'm not going to lie to you. This is probably the hardest part of the whole thing, I think. Because sometimes they just don't like to go in. I don't like pushing it too hard because it's so delicate. Oh, there you go. Yes. That is in. Whew! Okay, that is a relief. Right, let's put that to one side actually and put the dang buttons in. Let's get that in there. These can go in either. They're the same shape. <gasps> this is great. This is great. There's a little hole for that. We can put the membranes on now. There we go. They go, go on their little holes. That's good. All right, all right, all right. We're good, we're happy. And I'm gonna carefully do this maneuver. Okay, let's hold that carefully like that. Making sure that the speaker is in. And next, we're gonna put the 10 Phillips screws back in. Okay, getting nervous now. We're so close to finishing. Is it gonna turn on all okay and everything? I can't even see batteries. Okay, I've got the batteries ready over here. Oh, let's put the tri wing screws here. Uh, here we go, here we go. Shaking. Is there a step I've missed? Have I broken Ellen's Game Boy? Who can say? I'm just petrified that something's gonna snap or crack while I'm tightening. I'm sweating so much under my cap. Why am I even wearing a cap? Let's put this one in over here. Caref being careful to cross tighten. I'm going as diagonally as possible with these screws. If it's broken, you know, nothing, nothing no one's gonna care. Look, here we go. Doesn't look amazing? Before we put on the finishing piece, let's get some batteries in and just check I haven't broken Ellen's Game Boy. Yes, it's fine, I think. I'm gonna put uh, Dr. Mario back on inside, a clean Dr. Mario. 
the pièce de résistance. We're going to remove the sticky backing from here and get the screen lens on and it really is finished. Okay, sticky backing all off. What's going on? Oh my god, here we go! Should just stick into place nicely. There we are. Wow. I could leave Ellen the pleasure of uh, peeling off the plastic film like it's a brand new product, but I don't want to deny you watching and myself that treat because who's, you know, who's put all the effort in to, to do this? Me. So John gets to do it and you get to watch. Ah, oh, yeah. Come on. That is possibly one of the nicest looking things I've ever seen. Who's ready for the best sound in the world? One more time. Damn right. All that remains now, of course, is to get this in the post and surprise Ellen. Really hope you like it. Ellen? Oh my gosh. <laughs> Well, <laughs> John, I think I think Ellen is just frozen. We, we've broken Ellen. We've just broken. We've broken Ellen on. <laughs> Hang on, she'll hop. She'll hop back in soon. Um, wow, oh, no. the the love was so much that it completely broke the zoom feed. Also, hang on, look, I'm just <laughs> I'm just poking out the bottom here. Look. look well, at that. well, well, well. <laughs> look, if I, if if this is I the only see, thing, John, I can see the top of your head and the top of my head. Yeah. Oh my well, gosh! It's all right. We'll just we'll just we'll just ride through it. Um, if yeah. this is the only thing that ends up looking broken for the rest of the stream, I'll yeah. be Ellen absolutely will be hopping back on, uh, elated on, our, on 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 the video in any moment. Oh. I'm I'm sure. I mean, everybody saw that it did turn on. And actually, if I do this, yeah, then maybe people can see some more of my head. Uh, yeah, everyone could see that it did work before I posted it. Yep. So... John, you are in the clear. I can't wait for Ellen to get back because I need her reaction. Um, <laughs> Ross Turner says Ellen.exe has stopped responding. <laughs> That's basically yeah. it. I think, John, uh, what you did was so amazingly good and thoughtful and amazing and incredible that it has, um, oh. that it has basically uh, broken Ellen. It's broken Zoom. Or, I think or, it, or, or she's just left the call because she just wants to go and play Dr. Mario in private somewhere. Well, she can play. She's That's... got a whole life to play Dr. Mario now that you've refurbed her Game Boy. Yeah. We need her, we need her to get back. Come back, Ellen. Come back, and Ellen. Carry on playing. <laughs> right. Um, oh, my gosh. Okay. That background's uh, very good, Luke. Thank it's, you, isn't it? It's that's exceptional. You, it's hard to focus on the background. Hang on, let me just poke my poke my head up like that. It's hard to focus on the background. Um, yeah. <laughs> what do we need to do? Do we need to end? Do we need to hang up Zoom and re redial? No, Ellen, I don't think so. I think to... we we just need to wait for Ellen to um to hop back into our uh, our Zoom call, which um which I'm sure I'm confident she will. Well, nobody minds. I mean, we've had we've had plenty of technical probs. Yeah, our, yeah, exactly. Our, our from home streams. Okay, let me check in with the chat because they were understandably absolutely amazed. Sarcastic Ataku says John is so nice. CJ Franklin <laughs> says that was so nice and thoughtful. I love it. John, this is going to make you really uncomfortable, but you're you're yeah, basically yeah, yeah. about to be showered with an immense amount of praise. It is going to make me really uncomfortable, and I'm also all my face is all massive on the stream. So <laughs> yeah, it is. It's, well, good. It's even worse. Good. Put John's face under the microscope so you can all see him receiving your praise. Uh, Imio Jen says donating for more John restoration vids, please. Uh, and no one says Luke was wrong. I was. I wasn't disappointed. That was adorable. Good. 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 Um, I'm going to read this comment by Brock Sisson, um, which I think basically sums up uh what the chat was saying i was trying to find one comment that just yeah. summed up everything and it's this one from brock sisson who says i'm 32 but want john to be my dad ah uh, john that's... are you available to be anyone's dad because <laughs> a lot of people are keen <laughs> dad john yeah papa john yeah i well there was another there was another 
comment that's gone now. I think like tears I, in rain. I think it was. Mm-hmm. I think it was Tom Titherington. Yeah. Uh, I don't know, but it was something to do with. Um, it was something to do with the old man in Toy Story Two that fixes. Um, oh yes. Uh, to the and, effect, uh, uh, not Andy. Um, Woody, 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 fixes yeah, yeah, Woody. Yeah. He restores Woody. Yeah. Oh, there's something there. incredibly satisfying, and I could see everyone responding very strongly to it in the chat. But there's something immensely satisfying about things being fixed with tiny tools and extreme precision. Mm. Um, uh, okay, so John, this wasn't the first Game Boy you've restored, was it? Um, no. Um, I've only really done sort of three or four now, actually. Um, but no, it wasn't the first. I wouldn't have done it. I wouldn't have done. <laughs> wouldn't have done it. This being the first and yeah. filming it. You wouldn't have made Ellen's one your practice go. Although, actually, it was the first. Um, oh, I haven't got my. I haven't got mine to hand. It was the first uh, uh, doing a DMG, which is the the chonk, you know, the chonky type, like Ellen's, the big, yeah. you know. Um, so, so that actually was that actually was my first time fixing one of those um but uh, i'm going to give everybody a boring um behind the scenes fact just while we're waiting for ellen please do um because i think what you said there's quite important about why it might have been nice to watch is because you could see you could see all the little bits yeah and the satisfying little bits uh but i didn't have a way of like zooming in so i just shot most of it in 4k and made a <laughs> made a normal hd video and yeah. just cropped cropped in yeah you, you are know. the Christopher Nolan of Game Boy repair, John. I've always said it. Yeah. Premiere Premier doesn't really like me editing in 4K, though. No. Uh, or you know, or condensing imagine. 4K down to HD. But, you know, if I hadn't done it, you wouldn't have had the, wouldn't have had the close-ups. Maybe, um, maybe Ellen has actually been sent back to 1989 when the, ah. game, when the game Boy was first released. And, of course, Through Wi-Fi, Wi-Fi in the home just wasn't a thing there, was it? No, 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 that's my theory. Oh, it's a solid theory. Okay, uh, I've heard from Ellen on our DMs. She is, she is on, she is on the way back, having had to do some serious restarts. Oh no, poor Ellen. We sort of did. There was a freeze frame though, wasn't there, of Ellen when we came back? Yeah, we, we briefly came... saw, we briefly saw her face, and that was basically her face the whole time that she was watching your video. I think, John. Yeah, so we have we, you know, there's a there's a freeze frame of her reaction. At least it's not like, you know, it's not like we lost it completely. Yeah, exactly. So, so that's something. Um, Pura says I didn't have internet till '96. All right, John, brace yourself for more praise because I'm going to read. Um, uh, I'm going to I'm going to read you more of it. Um, David okay, Badalotti then. says bows to John. Bows, bows to John. Oh, welcome new member Danilo Mendez. Ah, oh, and Carl Conroy says if there is anyone who deserves something so good, it is Ellen. Wonderful work. Yeah, I love it all. Yeah, well, maybe I should say this while Ellen's not on camera, and then she won't feel uncomfortable. But you know, Ellen's had to be in a really harsh lockdown situation. She has. It's not very nice, and I've got I've got family members who have been shielding as well and it's and it's it's really it's really 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 horrible um and the hardest part about when somebody else is shielding is that really you you can't really do much for for them apart from maybe go and get a loaf of bread or a packet of rice or something um because they can't go to the shops um but you know because because i had because i had that already because she'd given it to me a while ago to you know, have a look at and have a have a have a play around with. Um, I thought, well, this is the per- that's the perfect thing to do because it's one of those things. It sits there, and you're thinking, oh, I really want to do that, and you don't get time. But then I said to Luke, maybe I should do it and make a video. And Luke said, yeah. So, yeah. That's Luke said, do I have to do anything? <laughs> and John <laughs> said, no, I'll do everything. <laughs> and I said, well, then I'm all on board, um, John. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, but you've you've made all the OBS scenes nice, so you have you have done something. I am the real hero. Yeah. It's true. Yeah, you're right. You're right, John. You were on the money there when you said I was the real hero. So so yeah. So that's that's why that's that's why I wanted to do it because 
Uh, Ellen does deserve it, going back to what somebody just said. So there. Laura Saw XD says, it's a wonderful gift. Now Ellen has something to do during lockdown. <laughs> yeah. Like she doesn't have loads of other games that she's still not got around to play. And Son of Liberty says, you are a good man, John Garnham. A damn good man. Ah. Uh, Which is I've true. Always, I just start, I'll just start. No, jo no, John, come back. Okay, don't leave me all alone on the stream. <laughs> no, I'm staying down here where, no. it's, where it's safe. Well, uh, all right, look. Oh, no, I'm in, I'm put in, I've am i gone back into my window. You should, oh, <laughs> I need to, which way do I need to lean? <laughs> which way do you need to lean to not be on this? <laughs> to, Blair says, John, you are so dope. Paul Zaleski says, John's a sweetheart. Uh, Anime's Life says, Ellen's computer was so happy that it crashed. <laughs> Claire um, T says, John, get back here and take compliments. And Claire T says, ah, oh, the Game Boy was so perfect it couldn't possibly be from this time and time travel occurred. Makes sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's our working theory, at least. Yeah. Um, and Metal Magpie says, Oxtra and Oxbox have been outdoing themselves with the sweet, wholesome content during difficult times. I appreciate you all so much. Thank you very much, Metal Magpie. But again, yes. this is all the work of, this is all John's work. Um, thanks, thanks very much. Yeah, it's, it is nice, though, isn't it, to know that... Um, uh, that, well, that's the best part of this job, isn't it? Really, making making stuff that um, is entertaining for for people, but especially at the moment, that's you know, it's very good, very good. Um, oh, actually, while we're while we're waiting for Ellen, um, yeah. it, it, just in case we don't get time, can I give out two shout outs for why I even know how to do any of this? Is that yes, okay? of course, of course you can. Um, Hang on, John. I'm going to I'm going to try and do like a temporary fix on our. Uh, on our faces just so you can see a bit more of you so it's a bit more normal even though i will massively regret moving anything <laughs> because okay. i'll have to move it again when ellen gets back that's fine all right here we go no that's okay. that, no that's no i made it worse right just no. go, go on john go with your shout out we can made see it worse you clearly did, made it worse and did nothing uh, doesn't everybody <laughs> doesn't 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 everybody love the, the background loop made as well that's just it's let's nice let's focus and... on, let's focus on really hard on that yeah background. look at the background and not the fact that evan's not in her window and yeah. i'm all in her window <laughs> um right now I'll do, I'll do the shout outs now because yes please i'm worried that i'm worried that i won't um there are two youtube channels yeah um, the Retro Future, mm. uh, and this does not compute. The Retro Future is basically all uh, um, handheld consoles, but mainly Game Boys and doing them up and making them lovely, doing things like backlighting them, so all different sort of sorts of mods. Um, and this this does not compute is kind of the same, but he does he does other stuff as well. But it's all nicely shot sort of got cool music and it's yeah i i watched those videos so much after i had um uh, a knee operation and they 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 really sort of uh, kept me going because they've made loads and they're still they're still going their channels are still growing uh, retro future has a instagram account so you can see loads of cool pictures of of game boys but yeah i only know how to do any of this from watching those videos well, John, Ellen is now in so the waiting thanks room. thanks to those guys. Oh, yes. I'm excellent. going to admit well her and hopefully let's see how it goes. <laughs> I can hear her. I c yep, I can hear her. That's, that's a good sign. Oh, okay. Rose. Um. <laughs> she made the noise. <laughs> she made a small Ellen noise. Uh, okay. Ellen, we can see you. On, you can see you. Yes. Okay. We can see you. Hello. Yep. Hello. Hello. We can see you. We can see you, Ellen. <laughs> We, we can, can see, see you. Oh my goodness. We are now oh in different goodness. boxes. Ellen. Hey. <laughs> let me oh move my these let me God. move these names. Let me move these um names. What's my name now? Who am I now? You're currently John Garner, but it's okay. <laughs> hang on, hang I on. don't want to be hang in on. the big box. I'm gonna do some I'm gonna this is real sketchy stuff. The one this thing I don't want to be I doing love you, John. mid stream. This is the one <laughs> thing I didn't want to happen. Yeah. Be in the big box. Okay, I've put you back in your in your had, proper box. Had had some technical uh, issues. Uh, <laughs> okay, Ellen, let's pretend that didn't happen. Uh, yeah. Fingers crossed. Yeah. Uh, you are still a little bit oh freezy, no. but we can Hang we can on. hear you. We can oh, hear you. I might be a little, little bit choppy. It's okay, as long as we can hear you, Ellen. React. Do do a react. Ah, <laughs> uh, hi. Ah. <laughs> uh. Um. 
Well, wasn't that blooming lovely? I keep yeah. you guys keep dropping out on the sound. Oh, okay. Oh, we're just not saying anything. No, yeah, we, yeah, we, we're, we're just, we're just. Listening Hello. To you. Can you can you hear us? Can you can you hear us at all? Hello. Yeah, but you keep dropping in and out. Oh, oh no. Okay. All right. Well, I'll tell you what, Ellen. You just keep. <laughs> you just... Yeah, just about, just about. Okay. You keep, you keep, you keep going. You keep talking, and yeah. and we'll either be there or we won't. But don't worry about yeah. it. Yeah. Ellen, did your computer break or did you just? Okay, go away as long and as cry? you can. Um, it was a bit of both. Uh -huh. um... <laughs> oh no. Um. I am, I am, uh, it was lovely, John. Oh my goodness. Um, watching that video, Good. oh my goodness. How grubby was that Game Boy? I think we uh, always, grubby. always forget. It was so grubby. I once got like a secondhand console from uh, a shop and it was disgusting. The, 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 um, the controller was just, oh, and I had to give it a real deep clean. So, uh, yeah, thank you for giving my Game Boy a little bit of a polish. And oh my goodness, the, the buttons! Like, Yay. I was just like, oh, John, if you would like to play a record, you were like saying about how much you enjoyed how doing that thing. So I was like, yeah. I thought, oh, I'm, I'm giving John something fun to do. <laughs> and watching that video seemed like you really enjoyed it, but you really made it your mission to make it like just such a nice thing for me. Yeah, yeah, and, yeah. And oh my goodness. And just Aww, for just for context, thank you, John. Um, how long ago was it, Ellen, that you sort of, uh, in an idle moment, gave your Game Boy to John, and said, "Oh, like back last end of last year," because um, yeah, John time. had like for our Link's Awakening stuff, he was he brought in his uh, Game Boy to show us, and I was like, "Oh, that's cool," and I was like, "But do you like doing stuff like this?" You were like, "Yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah,", yeah. and I was like, "Well." Would you want to like just? I just I just need a new screen, really. And you were like, yeah, not just a new screen. Gonna clean it all. In it, it oh, really it looks good. so satisfying. You know that scene in Toy Story Two where Woody gets fixed. Oh, we were just we were literally weird. while you were off. Yeah. We were talking about that. yeah. <laughs> somebody, somebody commented that. Like, Someone da, commented da, da, that. Da, 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 that one, yeah. That was literally yeah. in the it's, chat. Because it's especially with the cotton swab with on his eyes. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right, Ellen, get it's it out the box. It looks really. Oh good. God, yes, you got to open it. Free that thing from its box. Oh, I, I've forgotten about, as we were watching the end of that video, I started to just oh, feel incredibly fragile, anxious. fragile, like me right now. <laughs> <laughs> I, was, uh, I was feeling really anxious that she's going to open it. It's just not going to work because of, I don't know, a reason. Well, let's find out. Or other. Let's find it out. was fine when it left here. So it should be, it should be fine. We're going to find out. All right. Oh. Russell, Russell, Russell. Oh my goodness. Luke, Luke. It's not yes. a Game Boy. Oh, hang on. Oh, I've just remembered something. Yes. Yeah. Uh, it's actually luxury chocolate biscuits. Oh, what? <laughs> Please ignore. <laughs> well, you get luxury chocolate biscuits. <laughs> They're uh, good boxes. They're pass good. the sell by date, though. Uh, yeah, that's why I wrote please ignore. That's why I wrote a bit yeah. like the Game Boy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right, yeah. I I bought a lot of those boxes uh, of broken biscuits when I was hey, in self isolation. Luke. So <laughs> saved some. <laughs> I got one of those for you, didn't I, Luke? I'm sure you did. I got you got me one of those yeah. big boxes of biscuits because I'm they're, so they're, mad about them. Yeah, they're the misshapen ones that the factory. That can't was where sell. I'd seen it. It's yeah. At Luke's house. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. I went to Luke's house and he was like, do you want a biscuit? John gave me a it's, box of biscuits. It's the only type of gambling. Island, the factory <laughs> was unable to sell them. <laughs> <laughs> I, like, I like those because it's like the only type of gambling I'm prepared to do. You On... don't know what you're going to get inside. Right. It's very exciting. <laughs> it's like opening a packet of panini stickers. That is the most adorable form of yeah. gambling that I've yeah. ever heard of. Yeah, because I don't gamble, apart from with broken biscuits. Yeah, very smart. Yeah. Oh my gosh, okay, I, th oh, I think I think it's... Here we go. Oh, there's quite a bit of cardboard oh. in there. You can tell I was worried. Yeah, yeah, wow, John, you weren't taking any chances. Oh my gosh, it looks like a, a packed lunch. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Oh, John, you said it's <laughs> I know I can't go to the shops, but I'm all right. <laughs> Nimble Fajita says, John, you're too adorable. And Juji says, this is big yeah. dad energy. Yeah. Big dad energy. Yes. Right, so hit, yeah. Na, yeah. Na, na, oh, na. please turn on. Okay, John, you normally only gamble on biscuits, but now you've gambled on posting Ellen a Game Boy. The Royal Mail. Yep, you've gambled on the Royal Mail. Will they have treated <laughs> this package? Oh my gosh, with the respect it deserves. Look at that. Oh, John, I thought at least you'd keep some of the games for yourself as payment. No, no. Not the one that I didn't know. Okay. This is Chase HQ. Chase HQ. Okay. Chase HQ. Is it actually uh, brilliant? And I was you, uh, dissing I did see a bunch of folks in the chat saying, you, OMG, you Chase HQ is incredible. You the back of other cars. Oh, okay. okay. It, it, it was all right. You, you rammed into the back of other cars. That, that okay, was, sure. That was the main. Sure. Yeah, it's the main gameplay. Right. Like David DT early, says Chase HQ early is burnout. amazing. <laughs> Okay, here we go. Oh. <gasps> yeah, look at it! Woo! Yeah, it's beautiful! It. Yeah, but will it turn on and still work? Oh, that's amazing. Let's find out. John, find who cares out. if it turns on? It's beautiful. Oh. Encase it yeah. in purse specs. We sounded the Velcro. I don't know yeah. if you caught that. Yeah, that oh, we strap's got it. fine. That strap's fine now. It's just... The, the, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, spare buttons. Oh! Spare buttons. Right, yeah, the purple D-pad is in that baggie and your old buttons are in there. Yeah. So... Oh. Thank you to Deadpan Robot. Yeah, you can... Um, so if, if keep those safe. Dr. Mario. What would, yep. What's the use for the old buttons? So clean. Well, I didn't want to throw them away. She, I don't know. She might just... I don't know. My gaming experiences were with those buttons, Luke. <laughs> That's true. Oh my gosh, there's all so many memories in them. Ellen, let's uh, let's have a real good close up on the. Uh... Oh, look at that, John. You did well to find yellow batteries. I know. Yeah, oh, it all goes in. I know. Oh, turn it, turn yes. it on, Ellen. Turn it on, please, for for no, heaven's sake. You. Turn it on there's to you, Paul. everyone. Oh, look, there's oh, us. Look. Oh my word! It's behind the scenes. Hey. Oh, that's because it's, it's a glass lens. You see. And then because it's green. Oh yeah, some of it is green, green screening screen out. As well. Oh, amazing. <laughs> oh my oh. god, it's so beautiful, John. Oh. It looks, it right. looks good. Right, check it, check new. it works, Ellen. Please, please. That sounded good. That was a noise of power there. Yay! Yeah, okay. Right. That's lunch. I'm going. <laughs> no, John. Oh, man. You're not going anywhere. You're not going anywhere. Okay, get that contrast. <laughs> oh, Good. I'm very pleased. Oh, I'm happy now. Oh, uh, you might have to turn off your um, green screen back background, Ellen, to show us the to show us the screen. We've lost her. This Let's, is it. Um, She's now on, deep on. in killing Dr. Mario viruses. We, I'm Should trying we get a like to spike get... for that ding for the for the Nintendo ding. Was Dr. Yeah. Mario the original match three game? Is it a match three game? Does it count? I guess. Yeah. It's in I the don't know whether there was them. anything before, but it's I like had, one of the first, yeah. I had a Yoshi game that was called Tetris Attack. Yeah. And that was a match three game yeah. as, as far as I as far as I could tell. And that was a Game Boy game as well. Uh, but this is old Dr. Mario's older, so right, hang on, I'm gonna try and oh. Oh yes. Bring it in close to the mic, and we'll we'll be we'll just be quiet. Okay, wait. Here we go. Good. Yes. John, how relieved are you? Uh, incredibly. incredibly. <laughs> the one who snacks says, this song slaps. <laughs> what a tune, says 90s Pikachu. <laughs> Sounds so good. 
Um, Jack Dude. escaped the box again, says, and copyright strike. <laughs> no. I'm sure we'll be fine. That'll be fine. Evan Saunders says, so many virtual hugs. This is so awesome. Lo so many people, John, in the, in the chat have just been saying that this is exactly the kind of pure and wholesome and generous uh, uh, content that they needed today. And yes, that was good. all you're doing. Yes. Good. So well, thank well done. You. And as, I was as I was saying when Ellen was in a different area of the internet, um, that uh, Ellen deserves it because she's Aww. been all, she's oh, been yeah. all shut, shut away. You've That's been all true. shut away, Ellen. And it's oh, not thank fair, you, John. So. Lockdown has been hard on everyone, but it's been especially hard on Ellen. So she yeah. strongly deserves gifts yeah. and kindness. Yeah. But she won't be able to play oh, it in the dark because I didn't, bo I didn't bother you. to backlight it. You so. didn't bother to backlight it? What? End That's the stream. <laughs> you, did, you did the... <laughs> <laughs> I'm really glad that you peeled off the thing in your vlog <laughs> as well instead. Oh, yeah. I think that was, it was super satisfying with like a good camera so everyone can watch it, yes. and enjoy that moment. That's Lovely. exactly why I, that's the reason why I did it, not because I wanted to. John, would you recommend that anyone uh, try this at home? Absolutely. It's, it's, I try, I tried to make it look like, as, as I mentioned, those other YouTubers, um, like make it look doable. If you're ever interested in getting into fixing anything or any minor electronics, it's, it's, it's really doable. And you can buy different color buttons and stuff from different websites. And you know, if you give it a clean, it's a nice thing to go on your your shelf. Yeah, I've got the bug. Yeah. I've got the bug now, though. So I've got too many Game Boys. Um, I can reach one now. I've got one here now. Do you have a project that you want to do next? Um, yeah, I've bought. I've bought. Um, I have bought one recently on eBay, which is not here yet. And I, that I am gonna back like that one. This is this is my original one. Oh, nice, beautiful. Yeah. <gasps> oh my goodness, John! Look at that. Yeah. Oh, is that the pocket? Yeah, and it's it's all it's all cleaned and fine, but I wouldn't change that. Just like I wouldn't really want to change Ellen's too much because it's it's um you know it's OG. If you uh, want to do all the backlighting and all that nonsense, get a broken one and then yeah, do that because it's broken really? anyway. Oh, hang on, hang but, yeah. on. I don't want a virtual background. Hang but if people on. want there if if go. people want there more, you, you know advice on how to do that sort of thing just check out those channels i mentioned earlier retro future and uh this does not compute and it's easy oh so, now yeah. ellen uh, hold up hold get us up close to your webcam now that your green screen's off even closer let's, let's see that screen <laughs> closer 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 she can't oh, no, play not to the mic to the, to the to the um to the webcam Woo! Uh. Yes, there we yeah. go. We can see it. We can oh, see, we can see it. I can see it. Oh, I can see the lush. blue from your webcam as well. Yeah. That is the good yeah. stuff. Yeah. Oh, John. Oh. Um, Chelty for Daz says, thanks great. for making life a small yet significant amount more fun. I John, mean, I know there's a, a big fella. game out this weekend, but... <laughs> uh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the Last of Us 2 on the shelf. <laughs> <laughs> This is all we need now. You can just play the Game Boy while you're waiting for bits of Last of Us 2 to load. Yeah. Perfect, <laughs> Perfect combination. Uh, Michelle 86 says, my face hurts from smiling. Oh. Amazing. Aww. And Benjamin Lacey says, what a wonderful, thoughtful, wholesome thing to do. So sweet. I've not been letting John escape the praise, Ellen. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, no. John, you, you need to accept it. John, John is a very humble person. Hey! Hey! Um, hey! She did a whole. I finished virus. level one. <laughs> Yay! Woo! Oh, there we go. Oh, level oh, one of nine hundred and ninety-nine. <laughs> hey! We see it. We see it. <laughs> Aww. Yeah, eight hundred. Yeah. And MX says oh I was not prepared oh, for this much wholesome that's beautiful. today. Beautiful. It's so clean. Yeah. You can play. You can basically play Doctor Mario, can't you, on uh, Brain so Train? Good. How does it smell, Ellen? I think we've had every, se yeah, every other sense uh, detail. <laughs> Terrible. It smells clean. It's still got that, oh, it's still got that, like, that 90s plastic. Oh, good. Like, VHS tape smell. 
Yeah. Oh, Ellen, I did. I did one thing which I didn't wasn't really able to put in the video where I put my yellow, my uh, sorry, my Pokemon yellow in my Pokemon mm. yellow cartridge into yours just to see the fact that it's all the same yeah. yellow plastic and it looks really cool. Yeah. But I, I, uniform I, yellowness. Oh. Yeah. Oh yeah. Amazing. That was sweet. John, when you were um, repairing Ellen's Game Boy, what was the part that was most nerve wracking for you? The ribbon bit, taking those ribbons out and putting them back in, um, because it's just it's just a lot harder on those. On some of the that uh, terrifying. On some of the other models, they have these little clips that you can undo with your your finger now. Yeah. Um, and you sort of slide it into that, and then you you, you feel it slip in the housing. And then yeah. you just do the little clips and it holds it in place. Uh, and it's fine. But with that one, you literally have to just yank it out or push it back in. And you're thinking, oh, am I bending this? Am I, am I breaking it? Hang on. So, I, love this, I, love, I love this music so much. I'm going to mute the music bed that we've got on the stream so that the music bed can now be the Mario Land. Well, Mario okay. 2. Best, best Mario music. Do, 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 do. So good. My first Mario game, this was. Oh, dead. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm turning the music Because I was holding it at an angle. Here we go. Oh, that was a mushroom. Yep. Yep. I'm playing by ear now. Nice. Good. Everyone's just watching us singing along to this music now. All right, I want to hear the level complete jingle. <gasps> oh yeah. Oh, and then there's a okay. game you have to do. You have to do like a little bonus game. Yep. Okay, Mario is jumping through some of the question marks. Okay. But I don't know whether that's because the game is old. Hmm. Oh. Oh no. What Ooh. do you mean he's not he's not opening some of the boxes? Yeah. He's jumping straight through. Oh, so that works. That well, seems... it is it, it is broken then. I there think that's go. the game, not you, John. <laughs> Well, no, so this is interesting. Fine, John. John, maybe you can explain this, but am I right in thinking that uh, old cartridge games can fail because they have a like the save function is powered uh, by a little onboard battery? Yeah, that wouldn't have anything to do with um, Mario Land, though. You can't save in Mario Land anyway. You can save in Mario Land 2. Uh, it has a little, a little disc battery. Yep. Um, when that dies, that loses all of your save data. By some miracle, my original uh, Link's Awakening cartridge. Hey! Yes! Yes! <laughs> All right, music bed's going back on. Yeah. Yeah, oh. my, my I, ha I still have a, a, a game cartridge battery that still works. And it's ancient, so I don't know what's going on there. Brilliant. <laughs> wow, that game really doesn't hold back with the celebration jingles, does it? It's like... <laughs> <laughs> I would play it now, but I've got... What have I got? Oh, I've got... I've so got good. Donkey Kong in mind. Oh, Donkey Kong. Yeah. That's the good times. Donkey Kong, yeah. Mm. Yeah, I think I'm going to have to get a new Super Mario Land cartridge at some point. You're all oh, making me... Man. I do, because I think it's... Hang on, I have a Game Boy in this yeah. room, and it's just making... I just, I just want to hold one, because it's just making me ah! sad that everyone else is holding Game Boys. Back in a sec. Put one Game in your Boys. hand. Just so everyone knows, the reason why I like the Game Boy Pocket is actually the screen's bigger than the other one, even though it's a smaller Game Boy. So, yeah. <laughs> and actually, also, only needs two tiny batteries, so they're... Mm, none of your four double A nonsense. <laughs> there we two go. Two triple A's. Yes, Luke. It's got that well done. slight rattle to it. Nice. <laughs> It's got a healthy. <laughs> it's got a healthy technological rattle. My goodness. And that you is. Want yours uh, doing next. That is Tetris in there. In fact, you know Yay. what? Should we just do a little bit of uh, ASMR of like plugging in cartridges and sounds. 
Okay. Yeah. Yeah, this is a good microphone, so. Tato. It's made by Tato. Oh, yeah, remember Tato. Chase HQ! Oh, yes. I should have played it, didn't I? Right, here's, here's Donkey Kong going in. Oh, my batteries are dead. And coming out. Wow. Yep, fine. Gaga Communications Limited. Can't beat it. on this. So Lady Gaga been around for a while. <laughs> yeah. This is how she started. Wow. No, no one can see that, John. <laughs> right. Oh, look at this. Look at this. It's beautiful. Look at little uh, It actually lady. looks really good. This little pixely character. Oh, yeah. I should have had a, I should have had a go of it. Um, Mike oh. is defending Chase HQ uh, very oh, strongly. Brilliant. Well, he would because one of the it's, it's, he's in it. It's Michael. <laughs> is it? Oh, nice. Amazing. We could be George. George, good. Or uh, you can be all oh, Leon. Leon with Mike the Mike says the this game is better than Tetris. Which is a wild Ooh. claim. Oh, it might just be. It would have to be now that I oh, was. Oh, look at Dominic. Look at Dominic. Look at him go. And there's Jane. Mike and Jane are both in this game. There's a Mike and a Jane <laughs> in Chase HQ. What? Oh, my Holy gosh. heck. Coincidence? Impossible. All right, let's play as Michael. All right, uh, it's after 3 p.m., folks, so we're going to have oh to goodness. go and get it's ready It's after 3 p.m. For... It's after 3 p.m., so we're going to have to go and get ready for Oxventure soon. Um, yes. Um, Ellen, would you like to uh, Would you oh, like to say anything in closing? <laughs> in summary. In summary. Oh, my goodness. John, this was amazing. It's It's got a new lease of life. The, the yeah. purple and the yellow, just like... Look at and that, lovely. Colors. It pops. Purple and yellow just, just go together so, so well. The power button as well. Look at it. Lovely. Love it. Absolutely love it. Yeah. Uh, you've gone above and beyond, John, and it's so lovely. Happy you and like I, it. I'm, I'm going to rewatch that video uh, as well. Oh, good. I'm so pleased, Ellen. Oh, man. Let's. I, I, need, I need you all to. Oh, THQ! <laughs> <laughs> um all right i think we should um i think we should end the stream with we one should, more we should we should go because we've got to but we should end it with one more one more, one more one nintendo more turn on noise yeah 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 all right all well right. we've done the turn on noise hang on i know i know but i just want to i just want to go <gasps> oh dear <laughs> that is the theme tune <laughs> oh dear I'm so sorry, Absolute viewers. Absolute banger. <laughs> I'm so sorry this happened. Okay, thank you so much, everyone, uh, for all your comments. Um, <laughs> really enjoyed reading them. Sorry we couldn't get to all of them. Um, uh, yeah, thank, thank you, you Ellen, for not peeking in the box in all the time <laughs> that you had it. <laughs> That's She's a very right. good person. But uh, most of all, undoubtedly, thank you, another... John, for being an absolute <laughs> yeah. diamond. Oh, my goodness. Um, absolutely. Oh, look at this beautiful no problem. thing. This was a it was wonderful... A fun project. It was a fun project to do. So. It was a wonderful and kind idea, and you followed through on it incredibly, and you should be exceptionally proud of yourself, mm -hmm. and I'm sure oh, everyone in the you. chat will agree. Okay, okay thanks, well... Um, well done, Ellen. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, I think Mike will probably be popping a oh, link that, to. Well done, Mike. What? It was you. <laughs> uh, well done for opening it, and it's and yeah, you know, whatever. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> it was very well opened, to be fair. Yeah, yeah. It was a real professional job. Thank you. Good. Thank you. Um, okay, so I've got the Mike noise will be popping. To go. Oh, 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 okay, okay, okay. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Uh, Mike will be popping the link. Oh, in oh the yeah, thing. Mike will be popping a link. Yes, in the chat yeah. to Ox Venture. So go uh, check that out. Get in the waiting room. Um, and yeah, we will see you very soon for some amazing Ox Venture fun times. But <laughs> okay. okay, Ellen. All right, ready when you are. Okay. Yep.